We're fortunate at the Queensland Conservatorium to have some of the world's leading music researchers. We have Graham Jennings on violin, who works all over the world at the forefront of contemporary music. We have Steve Newcomb in the jazz department, also working at the forefront of his craft, composing, arranging and performing. We have Paul Draper, who is one of the great thinkers about artistic research. We have Stephen Emerson, who is a reinterpreter, trying to make sense of the past in our current environment. We're trying to permeate the boundaries of the inside walls of this conservatorium and spread out um, music and impact from our research here. So why does it matter that we make new music at a conservatorium? Why does it matter that we're trying to create something that wasn't there before? In a way, institutions like universities are the greatest single contributors to our cultural legacy in the country. In a single year, we might produce more than 100 world premieres of new works. We might produce um, more than 100 world tours of collaborative projects working with other musicians, trying to start conversations, musical conversations, but intercultural conversations that start to bring together differing points of view, differing ideas, which in a way is like a UN model for harmonious living. Music is our way of communicating across borders and of actually having some fairly deep, sophisticated, emotional conversations beyond words. In December last year, I went to Oxley Common, an area of Brisbane which is commonly used by bird watchers, canoeists and walkers. And in the middle of Oxley Common was a performance for 16 trombonists, five percussionists, a clarinet soloist and a few other people to the bemusement of the bird watchers and the walkers. This was an investigation of sound and environment, a reinterpretation of climate change, a look at how noises from aeroplanes and other things are impacting our sonic environment. Innovative, unique, but highly impactful with a very deep possibility of future 